Cold monkey now. Doo -doo. Blue, 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 boo, 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 boo. Oh, we're gonna watch the whole thing, baby bird. Oh, we're gonna watch it all. <laughs> Hit me. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff right there. So good! Though I really would have preferred to have Burn My Dread be the theme. Oh wow, that's a weird imagery. They hit us with that lotus juice tank. The same thing I always name it, Shin. Although, um, well... It might get confusing for you. Assuming it's the same as the original game. And you'll see why. <clears throat> I hope everything looks and sounds correct. I'm assuming they didn't change anything. I'm assuming I'm just playing Persona 3. Good, my stuff is running at high. Portalus full screen is good. Monitor one, V-Sync on, so that we actually don't get that insane, disgusting lag that happens when you stream. And I guess that's it, as long as subtitles are on. Uh, continue fast forwarding after events in, no. Maintain auto text, yes. Change voice language. I've never played the game in Japanese before. Dude, what do we know about the voice actors in this? Is this the same voice cast, or are they did they change them? Let's just keep it in English. I'm, I I don't... Yeah. Let's, uh... Ah, yes. I mean, I'm like an expert Persona man at this point, right? There's there's no reason for me to not, like, just put my balls under the crusher. Correct? It looks like it just, it's just challenging combat. Do we know what this actually changes? Let's see here. Persona 3 Reloaded Difficulties. Understanding difficulty differences in Persona 3 Reload. The consensus hints towards Merciless being a notch more challenging than hard. The conclusions are based on observed damage variances in game experience comparison. The advice from... My resentment place. Advising to stick to normal mode due to the rapid escalation of Persona game difficulty, they provide an amusing alternative perspective, citing Persona 2 as the only deviation given its slightly looser gameplay. The world of Persona gaming continues intriguing and challenging. Mm. 
Merciless, the option to restart from Tartarus entrance after a game over is disabled. A baffling fact, since the game warns player they'll lose all their progress anyway. The player outlined that on hard mode you take 1.3 times damage and deal an 80% damage, while on merciless mode the situation intensifies leading to 1.7 times damage taken, only 6%, 60% damage dealt. Okay, so maybe we just go with hard. I don't mind it being a little more difficult, but I don't want, like, to hate the game. You know what I mean? I mean, then again, if I put it on Merciless, I can actually lower the difficulty later. But I just can't go back to Merciless. What do you think, Jen? What is, what is your call here? What is your, what is your thoughts? Uh, that doesn't seem to be the case in this, Shin. From what I can tell by reading this, the it doesn't affect that. It just it just increases the damage you take and decreases the damage you deal. So, I guess it'll incentivize buffs and debuffs more. I'm going to start on Merciless. Yeah, I've beat this game twice and played through it a third time with P3P, but I didn't finish it for whatever reason. I mean... Like I said, worst case scenario, I have to knock the difficulty down if I'm getting my nuts kicked in. Time waits for no one. All are equal in its flow. All lives born to their ends. You who would protect the glimmer of the finite future. You have a single year. Go forth and live in the time given to you. Even in these halcyon days of repose, let your heart guide you and never stray from its path. I'll probably 100% it. Well, not 100% it. I'll do, like, all of the content. Please play Burn My Dread. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's it's going to go straight to Dark Hour. That's right. That's how this starts. I don't know that I'll stream the entire game, though, Shin. I'll probably stream a lot of it, but, like, I wouldn't count on, like, me being in the same place next time I stream it that I am when I end tonight. Just put it to my head. And then pull the trigger. Come on. There's no way I can't. I'm actually interested in to see how the weapons work, because I know, in the, I mean, in the original game, you had several weapons to choose from, um, or you could pick any weapon, but in the P3P remake, you were locked to either sword or uh, Itachi, Itachi, I forget what it's called, but like the, the, the spear sword. Nagita Naginata, yeah, thank you. Yep, his whole thing is being completely nonplussed about everything. I've arrived so late, I'd better hurry up. Iwatodai dorm. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. I think I generally stuck with um the bow. The bow, if I remember right, is like the way to go. Just so that you can get sneak attacks on shadows constantly and it lets you do stuff with the uh 
what you call it. Is this a coffin? The gold hands. It lets you actually get attacks on them. I wonder what's in these things. What's this doing here? These things are everywhere. Yeah, exactly. The bow was just the weapon. Hi. Cool. I honestly never thought I'd play this game again. It's because it's long, and I was like, I beat it. I know the story inside out, but like with the, with the improved graphics and combat and stuff, I've got to, right? I've got Welcome. to. Welcome. Hello there, mysterious boy, whom I have no idea who you are. Well, that was You're cool. Late. I've been waiting a long time. Auto. If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. That'll remember. Nah, I'm good. No god, I know how to play these games well enough. All right, please sign your name here. Your name here. What? Oh, I just unmuted my stream. All right. Magami. And is it asked for a nit game name? Oh, it doesn't ask for a nit game. Okay, you're not, you're not gonna be confused. Good. So I usually do Megami Tensei as my first and last name, Time and then my nickname is, is Shin. No one can escape delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. And so, it begins. Who's there? here at this hour don't huh. tell me wait huh the lights i didn't think you'd arrive so late my name is mitsuru kirijo i'm one of the students who live in this dorm Who's he? He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys. Uh, I don't know, honestly, Shin. Is it okay for him I to mean, be here? it's I been so we'll long see. since I played this one, and it's like a different this game. This is Yukari Takeba. She'll be a second. Because remember, spring, just like you. My um, my party in the olden days would be based on the uh, the uh, AI and stuff. Junpei's problem was he missed a lot. Swords and axes have a high miss rate. Um, but yeah, I don't really know who I will use or who I usually use. Because, I mean, I think Yukari was pretty much a given on the OG games because, like, she was the healer and she actually healed. But, whoa, that's an interesting little pop-up graphic over there for me. Why do you have a gun? <laughs> huh? Well, uh, it's sort of like a hobby. I mean, not a hobby, but... You know how it is these days. It's for self-defense. It's not a real gun, of course. It's 
it's getting late. You'll find your room at the end of the hall on the second floor. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? <laughs> Mitsuru. She I'll looking prettier more. than ever. Follow me. And she got them boots on. Das boots. Here's your room. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Um, do you have any questions? Um, does that kid live here too? <laughs> what kid? What are you talking about? Come on, that's not funny. Sorry, she doesn't know what you're talking about. Uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Mm. Yeah. Huh. Well, okay. Don't worry about it then. I'd better get going. Um, I'm sure you still have questions, but I don't even remember that. Okay. But I just meant Can like I... as far as her her in-game model. Like it's the best she's ever looked. It's the best any of them's ever looked, obviously. When you save your game, it also saves a little bit of your past. You can go back to that time by opening system and use Y, go on the system and selecting rewind. When you select the rewind slot, you'll be returned to a point where you could roam freely shortly before you saved your game. Note that the rewind function does not save your new starting point automatically. If you use this function, make sure you continue to save your game as necessary. <coughs> you can check the tutorial, blah, blah, blah. Bedtime. Oh, I have to put stuff in the closet first. I do not have any purchase DLC. This is just the freebie, well, the, the quote-unquote freebie version on um, Xbox Game Pass. Because I didn't want to pay full price for this game for a fourth time. While I put Great. you in a Let's trance go. with your body. You can't change the lyrics. Now I'm sad. This is how we'll be getting to school every day. It's a monorail. Pretty cool, huh? I honestly love the ride here. It almost feels okay, like Ian. we're flying over the ocean. Have fun with it. Oh, I got way, to chapter five. Last so this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. It's a lot of fun. Have you heard of it? The whole thing's man-made. And our school's smack dab in the middle. Oh, look, there it is now. I think I just got spicy Cheeto dust in my eye. That's not super fun. Morning. Well, here we are. Allow me to welcome you to Gekko Khan High School. I hope you like it. I guess you should go see your homeroom teacher first. The faculty office is over there on the left. They'll tell you more when you get there. Oh, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Which class are you in? Me? classroom assignments yet hey about last night don't tell anyone what you saw okay see you 
I don't know, maybe I should use a guide. Teachers older than you. Chidori, I remember her name. Huh? Well, that's strange. I even made sure to check the map, but where am I? Hunting room, welfare training, library, nurse's office, men's room. Maybe it's this way? Home ec. Need to prep. Music room. Man, I do not remember my way through here. At least this music is familiar. Oh, there's a mini map with helpful hints. How did I miss this? When Shin gets back, I need to tell him that I do want that guide, I think. student? Huh. Hmm. You're a second year, correct? Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, ten years ago, your parents... I'm sorry, I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. I'm Ms. Toriumi. I teach composition. So the reason I want the guide... Thank you. Yeah, just so I can do all the social link stuff properly and not like mess up anything. I'll handle the gameplay stuff myself, but that way I don't have to like play it again ever. What's your first name? I don't know why I asked that. You don't need to know my first name. Don't ask such things of a teacher. Maybe I could have gotten a different response if I had enough charm to be smooth. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. I need to mute this. <laughs> uh, for three hours. Oh, just the requirements? It doesn't actually give, like... What I was hoping for was an actual calendar, honestly. Oh, it does! Perfect. This is perfect. This is what I wanted. Come on. I'll show you the way. And so, another new school year is upon us. I'd like each of you to... Hang on. All right, give me a second. I have to do work stuff. I thought I was done for the day, but this dude just answered me. That's 
fine. I don't need to do anything fancy here. Remember the proverb. When applied to student life, this means... Psst. Hey! You came to school with Takeba-san this morning, right? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? What's the deal between you and her? Oh, and, uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. Why would I know? Oh, really? I thought you might know, but I guess not. Wait, that is what I said. How close are you guys? We met yesterday. Who's that? Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're gonna get me in trouble. That's okay, as long as it gets me close-ish. And you are? Me? Wait, that's still just Junpei. Junpei, Junpei or... That's still just I Junpei! When I was second year in middle school. Oh, I'm so happy! I kid at first, you know? So, I just wanted to say, hey, see what a nice guy I am? If that's not just straight up Junpei, then um, that's a very good imitation. Check it out. I don't know if I've ever showed you this. Oh god, my webcam's not on. You can't see anything. Hold on then. Yep, here we go. Check it out. See? Signed by Vic. I've had this since like 2006 or some nonsense. It's been a long time. It's in a plastic protector. That's why it kind of looks super gross. There you go. So it's funny, back when this game first came out, it was actually a super niche game that not many people knew about. So when I asked him to sign it because Junpei, he was like, you're the first person who's who made the autograph, the voice actor of Junpei. <laughs> that was the point. Vic Mignotta, I think his name is. But yeah, um, when I asked him for it and showed them the, the paper, he's like, you're like the first person who asked me because of Junpei. Cause he's like a really famous voice actor that did all kinds of stuff, obviously. Hey, it's Yucatan. Didn't think we'd be in the same But I didn't know that. I didn't know voice actors. I just saw that Junpei was there, and I was like, cool. Acting like everybody's best friend. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? What? I was just being friendly. If you say so. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? It must be fate. I don't have the courage to say that. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Uh, yeah, I know. Funny, huh? I wonder if this uh, game still has a three-hour startup. I'm in this class too. And what's up with that? Huh? What are you talking about? We just happen to live in the same dorm. 
Why do people always jump to conclusions? Have rumors been spreading about this already? Now oh, I'm worried. Hey, you didn't tell anyone about you know what, did you? You know what? Don't tell me you forgot already. Seriously, don't say anything about last night, okay? archery team you better not start any more rumors yukari's very pretty but i hate her neck thingy oh i can turn my webcam off now ah, who cares no one takes rumors seriously anyway she's so paranoid but hey it's your first day here and people are already talking about you believe it or not she's actually pretty popular you the man you the man well Here's to a fun school year, dude. Good. You ready to head out? Broski. I wonder if I could do this this way. Nah, it doesn't look like it. Oh, but I could do this. Sorry, bear with me. I'm trying to get it so that I can actually, like, see stuff. Oh, it's as small as I can make this, huh? Alright, I think I'm good now. Yo! All right, so it's the 8th. I don't have to do anything today. There's not going to be a ton of exploring in this playthrough. I'm going straight home. The side characters we interact with will literally just be for the social link stuff. This is a main story playthrough. Hey, it's Akihiko. Check out the jocks on their run. Say, you thinking about joining the club? Oh, wait. New members gotta wait a while before they can apply. Your stop's hitting with Todai, right? Forms, man. Must be nice. Talk about living life wild and free. Well, I'm going this way, so see you tomorrow. Everyone's excited because school's starting, but I don't really care. Over I think I need to go this way. Oh, it's what's your name? I want to go eat some takoyaki. She actually reminds me a lot of Nanako. I need to do anything on the seventh, so we're gonna hustle. Welcome 
Welcome back. Oh man. Oh man, that smooth jazz popping up in the Mitsuru saying welcome back. Dance. While I put you in a trance, you in your body, move so much of a bit, whatever like it. Oh, welcome back. Hey, 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 you live far away. This never expires. But we will chill today, then we brought the world tomorrow. Da, 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 da. Good night. I'm going out for a bit. Hmm? Have you seen the newspapers lately? There's a lot going on. I know. Severe cases of apathy syndrome are suddenly developing in people who showed no symptoms prior. It's been quite a topic of discussion. Oh my god, I wish this dude would go away! Why, why send an email? They say it's due to stress, but... Yeah, right. Boy, they... It's gotta be them. Otherwise... I get so tired of work stuff. You have a one-track mind. Will you... Be up... Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. That is not Akihiko. Akihiko sounds more like, this don't worry, Akihiko. I'm just getting a little practice. He's very breathy. That's not, that's not my, Ak hashtag not my Akihiko. Was there always only three? Wasn't there like five? Okay, this My is actually fully voice acted, Shinji so we'll Ikutsuki. let it play. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? That's why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. Please, have a seat. If you want to go ahead, we can do whatever. I apologize for the confusion regarding your accommodations, but it may take a bit longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Is there anything you'd like to ask? Um, no, I'm good. Excellent. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. 
I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. <laughs> Get it? Bookworm? <laughs> because your students? Shut up, Shuji. Uh, clever, isn't it? Or Ikutsuki, whatever. You'll get used to his lame jokes. I guess I'll head back to my room, too. Like the chairman said, you should get some rest. Transferring schools is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. Chill vibes. Good night, Tom. What's with that frantic organ in the background? Hello there. So, how's he doing? I had to take my headset off for a second. He went to bed a little while It was like, what a 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 Mr. Chairman, do you think he's... Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, Naomi? I mean, I'm cool with it, but if my parents found out... You don't need to know. Just drop them a text and it'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Uh, it sucks. <laughs> I'm serious. I was scared yeah, shitless. Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. And that's all for tonight, folks. Tune in again next week, same time, same place. The program you just heard was sponsored by Kirijo Electronics, bringing the future to you. The time is now 12 a.m. sleeping the dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight you could say it's the hidden hour during this time an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs well he doesn't have ears then he must be as you can see he's retained his human form he may be asleep but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour the only question that remains Spoilers. is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad. There's only three people on, on screen, like and this. never mind. I think I'd be really angry if Mitsuru was the twist villain. <laughs> oh, we going. Welcome. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Yep, it's new Igor. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between dream and reality. Mind, Mind and, and matter. matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Abide by your contract, and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. 
Uh, all right. Hold on to this. Hold on to these hands. Until we meet again. I mean, I don't mind that, Igor. It's just not the same, you know? Uh, don't sleep in class. Oh, you think so? Quiet, inmate. <laughs> now, moving on. Stay away. We we'll use the fast forward function on most of the non important story things so that, How's it going? you know, you we the beat the game sometime. I kind of want to beat it within a month so I can cancel my Xbox Live uh, thingy. Where? I don't know. Maybe grab a bite to eat? That's right. You're new around here. No worries. I'll show you. It's just around the corner from here. Let's go. Let's go. It's -a me, Junpei. <laughs> This place may not look like much, but I'm not complaining. Let's check out the CDs first. Oh, whoa, that's new. I gotta try this. Let me show you my mad crane game skills. Ah, damn it! Oh, come on, man. Junpei Rio. Leave it empty handed. Dude, I'm gonna look from the side. Yeah, that's it, yo. One more try. Just one more. Junpei spent all of his money. Junipario. Yo, these style things are awesome. The way that the the bar spins there. Don't make this a regular occurrence. You're not my real mom. I mean, I would call you mommy, but you know. Ooh, a sprint button. All right, so let's save real quick. And then we'll save, we'll make an extra save for the, uh, the review. I'm out. That's super cool looking. How is he? Looks like he's a little worn out. He went to bed without changing out of his uniform. Other than that, nothing has changed. I don't changed actually remember doing night. that, Shin. So hmm. probably not. Very interesting. I tend to avoid the MC super bosses in SMT games because they always require like perfect knowledge of the fight and a gimmick. Those who have the potential. The super bosses in general usually do. At first, memory loss, disorientation. This subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. Oh, don't look at it like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Consider it an opportunity to have someone your own age here. Besides, we need all the help we can get. I guess that's true, but still. Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <clears throat> You're not going to believe it. This thing is huge. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? Mr. Chairman, 
That's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. <sighs> Akihiko! <sighs> I'm alright. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. This is no time to joke around. Is it one of them, Sanada-kun? Yeah, but not an ordinary one. Ah! What was that? You've gotta be kidding me! Mr. Chairman, please head for the command Dun. room. Takeba, go upstairs Dun. and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? We'll stop it here. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's not like I asked him to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Uh, okay! This music is at... Persona 3 has, like, the most Shin Megami Tensei soundtrack of all the games. Of all the Persona games, anyways. There's no time to explain. We have to get out of here now. All right. Glad she had a sword on her. In her butt crack. The butt sword. Alright. We should be safe now. I mean, I'm just gonna do a small complaint. It's 2024. They could have given her like a sword uh, an animation holding a sword right there. I know it would have been a lot of extra work to model that, but like, come on. Takeba, do you read me? Yes, I hear you. Be careful. There appears to be more than one enemy. The primary one's lurking somewhere nearby. What? Uh, oh, let's go back. What are we gonna do? It's at the front door. Should we go upstairs for now? Let's go. Oops. Sprint. <laughs> Let's hurry. Stop stopping me. It's getting closer. You need to calm down. It's gonna be okay. Getting to safety is our priority now. You could stop stopping me. Sorry. It probably got inside. It's getting closer. Keep... Right. If we I did save, yeah. I saved before I went to sleep. Oh, it's time! Oh, they're doing it in-engine. They're not doing an anime cutscene. Which is great, honestly. I mean, the in-engine actually looks better than the anime scene, so... No way! Honestly, I think this is one of the coolest designs. Good thing he hit her with the palm and not the sword. It's here. <laughs> Wait. <sighs> Go on.
Go on. <laughs> I know this game so well. <laughs> Nah. I am thou. Thou art I. From the sea of thy soul I cometh. I am Orpheus. Master of strings! Still the least intimidating intro ever. Now this, this is an intro. Just as we thought. Oh, that's right. You don't even get to fight the first full moon boss. He just murders it because he's level 76 or some shit. to protect her let's go finally yeah <laughs> give me the music the oh, oh, give me the horn Yes, it's so pretty. There's no way I'm losing this fight, by the way. Unless this thing crits me right now, it ain't happening. You're the only one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck a radical soul chat, a soul mass destruction. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Sleepy time. Are you okay? Oh, come on. Oh, can you hear me? Oh, say something. He wakes up just long enough to say something. It's so good to see you again. You lost consciousness after awakening to your power. Ooh, I see that it was Orpheus who heeded your call. Very interesting. That was the power of Persona, the manifestation of your psyche. Uh, Persona? A Persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces as you react to external stimuli you can think of it as a mask that protects you as you brave many hardships i don't get it 
The power of a persona is the power of one's soul. And the soul is as you for the plead. Now time. Heishtnek. Unfair. It's the same conversation we have in every Persona game. I'm mashing through it. I've been unconscious for uh, nine days. You're awake. How do you feel? Hmm. Where am I? Thank goodness you finally woke up. Oh, this is Tatsumi Memorial <coughs> Hospital. It's just a short walk from the station. The doctor couldn't find anything wrong. He said you were just exhausted. Hey, um, I'm sorry I wasn't helpful at all back there. Are you talking about you took the hit for me? <laughs> wow, that power of yours was really something. What'd I do? That power you used, we call it Persona. And those creatures you defeated are shadows, our enemies. We'll explain everything later. I'm sorry I didn't tell you before. I, uh, I wanted to tell you something. I can kind of relate. To you, I mean. Uh, what do you mean? My dad died in an accident when I was little. And my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. You're all alone too, aren't you? To be honest, I already heard about your past. But it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine too. This was a while ago, but there was a big explosion in the area. Supposedly, my dad died in the blast, but nobody really knows what happened. At the time, he was working in a lab run by the Kirijo group. So I'm hoping if I stick around long enough, I'll find out more about it. That's why I'm going to Gekukan High. And why I was there when this happened to you. Not that I was much help. I kind of panicked. That was my first time facing them too. Sorry. You wouldn't have to go through all this if I weren't such a coward. Thanks. Sorry for telling you all this the minute you opened your eyes. While I was waiting, I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from him. As soon as he wakes up, I'll tell him the truth. So thanks for listening. I've been wanting to share that story with someone for a long time. All right, I'm gonna get going. I'll let the others know you're okay. They said you could leave once you regain consciousness. So I think you're free to go home. See you. You sure that I want to test me since I've been unconscious for nine days and seemingly haven't eaten anything? I am a oh, medical enigma. So dance while I put you in the trance. Hey, body. You and your body. Your body with your body. Make sure you don't hurt nobody. I say, hey. Hey, hey. <sighs> no. Something like that. for that, you know? Let me make it up to you. Come on, let's go. Home safe. Ooh, blah, 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 blah. 
I'm glad you're feeling okay now. Well, I guess I'll head up first. Like I said this morning, meet me on the fourth floor. The chairman should be waiting for us. Love this underwater theme. Oh, I can't use the item menu yet. Ah, there you are. Looks like you've recovered. I'm glad to see that. There are some things I need to discuss with you. That's why I asked you to see me so soon after your discharge from the hospital. Uh, please, have a seat. Oh, before that, I believe I mentioned his name before, but this is another coon. Hey there. Okay, let me start off by asking you this. Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? Uh, excuse me? That's a reasonable reaction. However, you've already experienced this truth firsthand. Do you remember the night you first arrived here? You had to have noticed the signs. Street lights going out, things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. I don't know what you're With talking so about. many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into a different time? That's the dark hour. A time period hidden between one day and the next. Hidden? I guess it's more like something people simply aren't cognizant of. But the dark hour does exist. And it occurs each night at midnight. It will happen tonight and every night to come. Normal people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the dark hour so interesting. You saw them, those creatures. We call them shadows. They only appear during the dark hour and attack anyone who roams free outside the coffins. It's our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just got hurt the other day. Now, now, he does his work well in any case. I'll get to the point, we are the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C. C's, for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. Mitsuru Kirijo-kun is the leader, and I'm the club advisor. A shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Apathy syndrome. I'm sure you've heard of it. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. Unfortunately, the police can't do a thing during the dark hour. Although rare, there are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as Persona, the power you called upon the other night. Shadows can only be defeated by Persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. I'm glad you're quick to understand. What he's trying to say is we want you to join us. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. <laughs> I was afraid you'd say no. I'm glad to hear you're on board. Thank you so much. Truly. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. 
<laughs> Hold up. But wasn't that... Oh, never mind. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the fool art. Uh oh. I didn't feed the cats. Gotta feed the kitties or I will get murdered. Well, that's all for today. <clears throat> I'll follow up with you regarding our club activities later on. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Tomorrow is Sunday, so take some time to relax. Well then, shall we end this meeting? You know. Because it's the weekend, shall we end? Shall week end? Get it? I wish there was a shut up button. Hi, how 
have you been? <laughs> I'm always by your side. Soon, the end will come. I remembered, so I thought I should tell you. the end of everything but to be honest I don't really know much about it I'm gonna cut the stream and just go chill